Hello auto lovers, welcome back to Auto Universe channel, we hope you guys in good health. Today we gonna show you 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander walk around in review and explain the details of the car, we hope you guys enjoy it. Please don't forget to subscribe for more videos, thanks for watching. Toyota seems to be very serious in its effort to cover all the possible customer needs in the SUV segment. Amidst all the crossovers and SUVs available for sale already, the renowned vehicle manufacturer is now adding the Toyota Grand Highlander to the offer. Yes, you probably heard about the Highlander's bigger sibling. The 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander appears to have an aspiration to sit above the standard Highlander but below the massive Sequoia. That's hardly a surprise, considering the size and capability of the latter, which Toyota understandably wants to preserve as the top-notch offer on the shelf. The 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander seems to tend toward customers needing more space than the standard Highlander can give them. But the question is, why not go for Sequoia, then? Here's why waiting for the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander makes sense and why you may actually choose to buy the current 2023 Toyota Sequoia. Although the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander aims to improve passenger and cargo space compared to the standard Highlander, it will likely do so contracted to the Sequoia 2. The Sequoia is undoubtedly a larger SUV than the midsize Grand Highlander, but the former seems to be making better use of its space. To illustrate, the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander will provide 153 cubic feet of total interior space, 21 cubic feet of cargo space with all seats up, and as the brand claims, an adult suitable third row. On the other hand, the 2023 Toyota Sequoia offers 86.9 cubic feet of total interior space and a pretty cramped third row that doesn't even fold flat completely. If you ask us, this makes the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander well worth waiting for. The all-new Toyota Sequoia is huge. Like, really huge. It measures as high as 208.1 inches in length, which can admittedly make it less agile in some settings and situations. The 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander will likely offer more agility in this sense, as it will fall into the midsize SUV segment. Yet, as we mentioned above, the overall passenger and cargo space are likely to be better appointed than in the Sequoia, which makes a huge selling point for the Grand Highlander. Although we still don't have official estimates on the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander's fuel economy, the manufacturer estimated MPG is 34 combined. If that proves to be true, the Grand Highlander will be more fuel efficient than the Sequoia with its 20 to 22 miles per gallon combined ratings and make a better choice for customers seeking daily efficiency. In terms of practicality and efficiency that we mentioned, the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander will also look less extravagant than the Sequoia. Its sleek, refined, and more compact styling inside and out may actually appeal more to some customers and significantly influence their final decision. But then, this is ultimately a matter of personal preferences. Following our previous point, the 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander may actually prove less expensive than the 2023 Toyota Sequoia. While the latter starts at $58,365 for the base and as high as $76,365 for the top trim, we expect the former to start at a little above $40,000 for the base and slightly over $55,000 for the top trim. But as Toyota has not yet revealed any pricing details, we'll have to wait and see how our predictions turn out. The all-new 2024 Toyota Grand Highlander is on the way giving the world's biggest auto manufacturer another tool in its vehicle arsenal. We know plenty about the 2024 Grand Highlander, from its dimensions to its powertrain options. Yet, there's one essential item that we still don't know about the new three-row Toyota SUV. The Toyota Grand Highlander will boast an available hybrid system that outpaces the Highlander Hybrid in terms of power. According to Motor Trend, the Grand Highlander will offer the hybrid max powertrain as an option. It's the same powertrain as the Crown Platinum and has an impressive 362 horsepower. 